Hi there, this is Ranjit and I have the iPhone 12. Uh, I have already posted this unboxing video a couple of days ago. And some of you were asking me, does the iPhone exhibit any heating issues? In my regular usage, guys, I did not find any heating issues with this new iPhone 12. Uh, the only place where I felt that the back was getting a little bit warm was uh, when I was taking a lot of photographs outdoors, but that happens with almost every phone. So let's do one thing. Let's actually uh, play a game that is Call of Duty for about 15-20 minutes and see if it exhibits any heating and we'll also see uh, how it uh, fares in terms of battery life let me adjust the brightness guys and as of now as you can see it's about 84 percent battery and the time is uh, 12 52 so let's uh, just uh, fire up this uh, call of duty and uh, see and i also have this temperature gun so and i hope it works it's uh, the temperature is about 25 degrees Celsius, 25.5 as of now. Let's see after uh, continuous gaming, how does it affect? So this is Call of Duty. And let me just skip this, guys. Speakers, pretty loud. So guys, just started this uh, Call of Duty. It says pre-match. Uh, so yeah, the crash level. And let's see. And uh, I like the stereo separation, guys. Uh, the stereo separation is good. And I'm not keeping it on max volume, I could say about 80%. Let's see how it handles it. And uh, let me just show you the graphics settings. If I go to settings uh, and if we go to audio and graphic, very high. And frame rate, I've kept it also at very high. Let's put it on max and see what happens. So we have maxed out all the settings. Oops. Oh shit, there's one more. So, so far very smooth guys, even at this max the frame rate are very very smooth. Gameplay at least, that's what I'm noticing. Friendly killer drone oh, got three kills with the hunter drone. Enemy contact. So, very smooth gameplay, guys. And notice we are at the highest setting. Oops, my bullets are finished. Shit, bullets are finished. I never like this. Ah. So looks like because of the bullets, I will die. Yes. So in terms of, uh, I would say, gameplay, as you saw, no issues. Very smooth, and uh, must be about five minutes since we are gaming. You can get the kills very easy. I wonder if it was just 120 FPS. This is a 60 FPS screen. How even smoother it would have been. But very smooth. As you can see. And oh shit, I'm going to make it. Catch here. Oops, they're not here. They are there. Oops, they are there. Let me use this flamethrower. So very uh, smooth gameplay and uh, it's not heating up also. I noticed a slight warmth at the back. That's sure. Oops, I might die trying to kill him. <laughs> Sling thrower is cool. Up, 
got a Use the drone. Ah, this hunter, hunter killer. Target in sight. Yeah, hunter drone got it. This is having a 6.1 inch screen. Uh, I would say the max would be better. Because that has an even bigger screen. Again, a V1. And the game is finished. Let's see. Oh, I got the final kill. I just got the final kill. And, uh, yeah. Again, I don't see any heating. Let's see. Let's go back over here. Yes, the temperature did increase. Now it's about 32.6. But guys, this is not hot at all. It just feels warm. But we'll continue, guys, and see how it handles it. So, guys, next uh, one more level. Let's see. Oops, it got killed. I think so I joined in the middle of this one. Oops, that was a bad head. It's gonna kill me. Got him. So, uh, guys, very smooth gameplay, that's what I'm liking. Oops, shit, why shouldn't reload keep on and die? Yeah, I have a very bad habit of reloading after each kill. But uh, it will be great gaming experience, guys, as you can see. Very smooth. Oh shit! I'm gonna die now. Yeah, the bomb. So definitely, I would say good gaming experience and no issues of any heating also. Enemy contact! Really like in flames. Wow, that was a good shot. I didn't see him. Let's look at the temperature now, guys. It's been just over 10 minutes. Let this go. And uh, still about 34, 35 degrees Celsius that max we are seeing. So yes, slightly warm but not hot at all. Let's continue this. Oh, I got the flame thrower. I like the flame thrower. This is nice, actually. This is actually pretty good. <laughs> so cool. Oh, I finished it. Oh, that's crap. Oh, I got one of you. So, again, guys, uh, we'll have great time playing the game. And as of now also no issues of any heating guys he'll be close to about 15 minutes oh he's invincible shit oh no he's dead. oh shit oh, I'm gonna die this is stupidity <laughs> Anyways, let's check the temperature. It's almost about 13 minutes. Let's just see. Yes. Still about that 34, 35 guys. So it's not going over that. Here also if we look at. Actually this area is the warmest. So yeah. Just feels warm. Not hot at all guys. Very smooth campaign. Enemy contact. Oh, we got defeated. Oh, 47.50. That was close. 
Uh, but guys, as we saw, uh, again, no heating. We played uh, actually two matches back to back. So approximately about 15 minutes of gaming. And now if I look at this, again, just 35, yeah, 35 is the max that I did notice. So definitely not getting hot. Yes, it's a sort of winter, not super, super hot. So it feels warm, guys, but it's not heating as we uh, saw. And this is after about 15 minutes of uh, gaming. So definitely, yes, some people were telling that it overheats or something. No, it's not overheating. It's just because that it's having the glass at the back. If, even at about 35 degrees Celsius, as we saw, it is feeling it is warm, but no way guys it's heating. Heating means it should have gone to 42, 43 or 44 degrees Celsius at the back. But that's not what it's happening. Uh, initial impressions guys, the battery life that I'm getting also is uh, very good. But again guys, stay tuned to my uh, channel. I will be posting its full review with its pros and cons very soon. And if you guys want to know anything specific about this iPhone 12, let me know. I'll try to cover it in the full review. Anyways guys, that's it for now. Thanks for watching. This is Ranjit and I hope to see you in my next video. Take care guys.